Welcome back to Google Guru. This video is brought to you by Roundtable Technology. Hello, my name is Joshua with Roundtable Technology, and today I'm going to be walking you through how to use Selective Sync with Google Drive to synchronize just the folders that you want from your Google Drive to your local computer. So you can download the Google Drive for your computer. Um, I'm using a Windows computer here, but everything here will work exactly the same on a Mac computer, except for one small thing, which I'll mention when we get there. Um, so Google Drive, of course, is very handy for storing lots of folders and files online, and you can divide things into folders which you share. But when you synchronize uh, your your files locally using uh, the Google Drive application, you require all of that space for all of your online files um, on your local computer. And if you have um, some particularly large folders in your Google Drive, that can cause you to run out of space on your computer. So here I've got a big project, a medium project, a project that's been shared with me, and a small project. I'm going to show you very quickly uh, a useful tool, which is gdrivefoldersize.appspot.com. And this tool allows you to very quickly see the size of all of the folders within your Google Drive, or the folders that you have permissions to. So you can see here that my big project is taking up almost a gigabyte of storage. My medium project is about half that. And then I have my shared project and my small project, uh, which are quite a bit smaller than that. So what I'm going to do is uh, use Selective Sync in order to remove the big project from my local computer. I'm going to go down to my Google Drive icon, and on a Mac, this will be in the upper right-hand corner, but you'll see here on my Windows computer, it's in the lower right-hand corner, and I'm going to choose Preferences. Here I can choose to only sync some folders to this computer. I'm going to select my medium project, my shared project, my small project. I'm going to leave my big project unchecked. I'm going to apply those changes. It's going to warn me that the big project will be removed from this computer. It's not going to delete anything. Those files and folders will all still be available on my Google Drive online or on another computer where I might be synchronizing this. It's just going to be removed from this computer. Click Continue there. I'll go back to my, my Drive online. You'll see my big project is still there. And in the lower right-hand corner, it should say Sync Complete Already. And if I go back to my folder, you'll see that the big project has been removed from my local computer. So that's just a quick way that you can use Selective Sync with Google Drive in order to uh, control the amount of storage that's used on your local computer. Thanks very much. This has been Joshua with Roundtable Technology.